Good morning. This is Elizabeth. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. Two this time, I believe, and there seems to be an acquaintance of yours among them. I suggest you carry out a rescue post-haste. Goodbye now. the net cafe why don't we go someplace else wait let me see how much money I have oh no where's my wallet did I drop it but when I had it when I pulled out my train pass wait someone bumped into me outside the station sorry I'm gonna go back there and look around it'll just take a minute make sure you wait right here okay I'll be fine, so don't come after me. Stay right there, you got it?
What you say? You better shut your mouth, bitch! Ha! <laughs> if you don't behave, you'll lose more than just your wallet. them up so badly <sighs> hey why'd you come after me didn't I say to wait did you think I needed saving mm. I'm not helpless you know I got my wallet back by myself I didn't need your help Apologize. I should be the one saying sorry and thank you. I'll just go on ahead. I'm all right now. Sorry again. See you. I recently expanded my outdoor exercise regimen, and I wanted to boost my nutrition and match. So I got some pork liver today because it's supposed to be rich in iron. But I don't think it'll taste like much if I just boil it like usual. That's why I'm gonna try cooking a pork liver stir-fry. I already looked up how to make it. Think you can help out? 
Good to hear. You like this dish too? I've already cleaned the meat ahead of time. All that's left is to cook the liver, and stir the chives and bean sprouts in. And that should be it. Wow, this is great! I guess it was a good thing I took the time for all that prep. They say a boxing match is decided before the bell even rings. Maybe this is kind of the same thing. <laughs> oh, sorry. Obviously, this wouldn't have been possible without your help. I've still got a lot to learn. But it's hard to make time for it with all my training and stuff. Maybe if I attach weights to the pen when I'm flipping, I could kill two birds with one stone. Attention, please.
I'm looking forward to it. Are you accepting a request? Wonderful. How splendid. stole my wallet and you came to help me um sorry i got so mad at you i was just frustrated i don't like having to depend on other people but it ended up happening anyway you know i couldn't say it at the time but i'm actually glad you came Maybe because it's you. So, I want to thank you properly. Thanks for your help back then. I really appreciate it. It was honestly kind of cool. big weight off my shoulders. Let's head back down. The roof doesn't get a lot of foot traffic, so I think it's a good place to have serious conversations. But couples tend to sneak up here too. If anyone sees us, the rumor mill might go crazy again. Wouldn't that be annoying? <laughs> you know, if people assumed we were dating. <laughs> really? I'm not sure if you're being brave or oblivious. Still, what's something special about you? You don't get bogged down by what other people think. Uh-oh. They say a sneeze means someone's talking about you. <laughs> well, it's probably nothing. Let's head on home, yeah? Welcome back. Leader. I have a suggestion.
Hello. when I have someone reading next to me. It's getting pretty late. Should we wrap up for the night? I'm so... What is it? And what's with this scary look? What do you think you're doing? Just practicing? Well, that's enough practice for you. Get your butt to the nurse's office. The rest of you, get back to it. The nurse's office? Miyamoto, did something happen? a bad liar. You can totally tell he's going easy on one knee. I know you have something to do with this. Sorry, but you're coming too. I just had a call with your mom about your knee. You're throwing caution to the wind, young man. A blabbermouth. I want you to stop before things get any worse. You got that? Please don't do this to me. I need to practice. I heard, Kaz. Yuko! And you too? Take some time off, Kaz. Practice can wait till you're all better. I can't! I don't have time! 
What's the rush? Why do you do these things to yourself? You've been hanging around with Miyamoto lately, right? You must know what's going on. Wait. He has nothing to do with this. I don't want you to get dragged into this. So I'll come clean. So, the truth is... And that's the gist of it. So I need to practice. I have to win. Or else... I know how you feel, Miyamoto, but... It all depends on me if my nephew ever walks again. So that's what's going on. I don't mind if he competes in the regionals. It's just the individual competition, so we don't have to worry about him bringing us down. Hey, what happened to practice? We were worried about Miyamoto. Guys... I'll let you keep training for now. We'll see how things go. But if I tell you to stop, I'm sorry. You're gonna have to listen. And I want you to go home today. Linda will be upset with me if I let you stay. Sorry, Coach. Everyone, I... I think we're done here. The rest of you, back to training. in the fridge to make a cream stew. I've heard it's healthy from leaf to core, so I'll go ahead and use the entire thing. As you can see, I've done my homework. <laughs> Did you come prepared? I'm back on my game after making that perfect chicken saute. This will be no problem at all. Okay, less talking, more cooking. I'll handle the main dish with the cabbage, so how about you start on the rice and stuff? Whew, I'm stuffed. We made short work of that, huh? So, how'd you like today's meal? Oh, you said it! You actually said yum! Finally! I just had to get you to say it today. Hey, remember what I said the very first time we cooked together? That I'd make it so delicious you couldn't help saying yum. I'm pretty stubborn, you know. But I gotta say, it's nice seeing the look on someone's face when they're eating something they really like. 
It's not just about proving myself. It's that I really wanted to see that smile again. <laughs> Did that make me sound selfless? Sorry, but this is still a two-way street. Next time, it's your turn to do something for me. Let's make some yummy memories together. Thanks for today. Let's do this again when you have some time. Okay, let's hurry and get this cleaned up. No one was here, so I figured it'd be okay. It's rare to see you here. Is it for the archery team? Yes, the teacher wanted a report. I see. That's a lot of responsibility. Oh, not really. It's nothing compared to what you have to do. Actually, uh, I wanted to ask you something. Senpai, what are you fighting for? Well, I... I guess you could say... It's my way of atoning for the past. In my case, I don't think I really have a reason anymore. I mean, I know the whole story about my father now. I guess I could still fix the mistakes he left behind, though. Maybe I should have thought about this earlier, huh? But it took me this long to start questioning myself. That's understandable. It seems like everyone has their own reason for fighting. Well, defeating the shadows is probably a good enough reason, huh? What are you trying to say? I'm not exactly sure. But it's all gonna be over after the next full moon. So there's not much point in thinking about it. That's true. Once we put an end to this, we can go back to a normal high school life. The rest of the student council will be here soon. We can pick this up later, though, if you want. Oh no, that's okay. Thanks for listening. as you. Oh, I was just thinking. Doesn't eating fish remind you of the ocean? It's a part of our lives, I guess, living along the coast. We even spent our vacation at the beach. Hey, after all this is over, why don't we go somewhere different, like the mountains? We could have lunch outdoors. Maybe we'll even see a deer or something. <laughs> what do you think? Right? make us lunch. I might not look like it, but I'm a pretty good cook. Just you wait and see. <laughs> it's been a while since we've talked about going on vacation. I'm excited just thinking about it. I'm not sure how to say this, but when I'm with you, I don't feel so alone. I mean, I do have friends, and there's everybody at the dorm, but... Usually, I feel like the real me is trapped somewhere deep down inside. Maybe it's because of my family situation, but I'm always pushing people away without realizing it. Lately, though, that's been changing. 
And I think it's thanks to you. Delicious. It's getting late. Shall we head out? I see you're back. By the way. What a coincidence. Hey, I didn't know you had a dog. Is that a Shiba? That white fur is really nice. Almost makes him look mystical or something, don't you think? What? Oh man, he just looks so cool. I wonder how soft he is. Well, I don't want to make him uncomfortable or anything. Hey, do you think I could try petting him next time? I'll study up the proper way to do it. Amazing commodities! I'm going to do it! Good, good! Not bad, kid!
Nein. This late. Ah, walking the dog, huh? I didn't know you had one. We used to have a dog, too. Man, that brings back memories. What? <laughs> He's a lively one, isn't he? I bet running alongside this little guy would be great practice. For now, I'll run along home. I'll see you later. earrings I've been wanting new ones but I can never seem to make up my mind they're all so cute you know there are too many options to choose from I know why don't you come help me pick something out yeah come on then let's go uh, hang on I've got a call Hello? Uh-huh. What? You're not doing it? You want my approval first? Wait, it's fine. You can do what you want to do. What I mean is... If that's what you really want, then go ahead. It's your choice, so... You really don't have to worry about me. Well, then... You want to meet up and talk about it? <sighs> hey, stop it, don't cry. I'll try to call you more too, okay? All right. Bye. <sighs> now it's my mom. She apologized for everything that's happened. She said she won't get remarried until I'm okay with it. weird. I can't stop shaking for some reason. Can we sit for a while? So, 
sorry about all that. I'm fine now. I was just surprised. I never expected this to happen. I told her we could meet up and talk about her remarriage. I'm nervous just thinking about it. I don't exactly want to. I'm afraid it might get ugly. We haven't seen each other in almost 10 years, so it's not going to be easy. I'm afraid I'll get angry and say something cruel. Still, I think it's time I try talking to her. I've been saying how wrong it is to run away, so I need to live up to my own advice. You know, I think she still misses my dad deep down. But she couldn't handle it, losing someone so important to her. That's why she needed someone to lean on. I think losing someone you love and having to go on alone is really, really hard. I'm not sure how to explain, but I realized this after being with you. I think being in love means giving a part of yourself away. And that's a wonderful thing. <laughs> I mean, just in general, you know? <laughs> the earrings can wait till next time. Let's just go home for today. Welcome back. I have a suggestion. Um... That's great. Our hero took an underdog baseball team that didn't even have enough players all the way to nationals. No matter how tough the rival or desperate the situation, the hero always ends up finding a way. Hey, we're technically a team too, aren't we? Means we need a hot shot of our own, right? <laughs> Sounds an awful lot like hero talk to me. Share some of that glory, why don't you? Hot shot or not, the others have got so much personality. Kinda like the characters in a manga. Either way, kinda blows a real life can't be like how it is in a manga. Anywho, on to the next page. Oh yeah, that's right! Just before the big game, the hero collapses! All after getting everyone together, training like crazy, becoming a hot shot hitter, and carrying the whole team all by himself. Dying to know what happens next, huh? And I'll borrow the rest of the volume from my buddy, Ronto.
Let's make this quick. This room's smaller than my bedroom, but it's still surprisingly big. Let's take a break. So, I've decided that I'm going to study abroad. To be honest, I'm not really excited about it. But I already told my teacher I don't want to be a doctor, so... <sighs> Do you want something to drink? It's on me. Oh, I almost forgot. Did you want something cold? Or maybe... Hey! Look out! Hey! Hang in there! Can you hear me? You're awake! Oh, thank goodness. I kept calling your name, but you wouldn't wake up, so I... I don't see any cuts on your head, so I don't think you'll need stitches. Can you remember your name? Oh, that's wonderful to hear. Really, it's such a relief. Well, your pupils aren't dilated, so I don't think you have a concussion. I was worried that when you fell, you hit your head or your face, and I... Anyway, do you remember what happened? The box. I was the one who put it up there. We have a maid who cleans our house, so I don't do much cleaning myself. And I just got lazy and put it up there. It's all my fault. I'm so sorry. All I could think about was what would happen if you didn't wake up. I was so scared. I felt so helpless seeing my friend in trouble and not being able to do anything. I'm not a doctor. <sighs> when I was younger, my dad told me a sad story. About how he lost a good friend. He just collapsed one day, even though they played together all the time. Seeing you lying there, I understood how my dad must have felt losing someone he was so close to. Do I want to be a doctor? But I'd be doing exactly what my dad wants. Uh, sorry. We should get going. Can you walk? Here, you can lean on me. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Salut. Let's go. 
good. Just to be safe, we should adjust the amount of fertilizer and make sure they get enough sun. They look like they're growing fine now. <sighs> what a relief. Oh, I only lent a helping hand. I'm sure tending them is important. But it's all thanks to the plants themselves for being so strong. You know, after I treated the plants when they were sick, I kept coming back here to check on them. I noticed that the spots where we had cut off the leaves were already sprouting new ones. And in just a little while, they were healthy and green all over again. Maybe I'm making a big deal of this, but it made me realize that life is actually quite amazing. It didn't matter that they had been weakened or had damaged parts. Just giving them a little support was enough for them to show how strong they really are. Yes, it really gave me hope. I think in a lot of ways, we're just like them. I'm not sure how to say it, but I hope I can be as resilient as these plants are. check on the plants one more time just to show my appreciation maybe if i keep thanking them they'll grow even healthier all right that should do it shall we head back down It'll be a full moon again in just another week. Finally, this will be the twelfth ordeal. Are you ready? I can't tell if time's been at a crawl or flying on by, but either way, a lot's happened, hasn't it? It's a bit soon to be reminiscing, though. How about I come see you once it's over? Be careful now. is really not okay. Is it because we're both Persona users? Or are we actually good friends? Or do you, by any chance, have feelings for... What do you really think of me? What? No way! Are you serious? You're not pulling my leg, are you? Do you really mean it? Wow! Uh... <laughs> Sorry. It just feels like a weight's been lifted off my shoulders. The tears won't stop coming. You're so hard to read. 
You're always so kind to everyone. That's why I thought you saw me as just a friend like everyone else. Lately, I found myself getting upset when I've seen you talking with Fuka. It made me scared that I was turning into a petty, jealous person. I felt awful about it. So, um, I'd like it if you had eyes for me. And only me. Of the cooking. You just eat and then take care of cleanup afterwards. This time I want to try hot pot. I can probably handle that, right? Hey, don't worry. We've got chicken, onions, carrots, mushrooms, tofu. Hmm, nothing strange here, just regular ingredients. All right, why don't you go get a plate and sit tight? I've been so busy lately. I've had to leave most of the boxing team activities to the junior members. But they actually won a team event at a rookie tournament. So, I thought I'd put together this little celebration for them. Actually, I've been so occupied with my own problems that I haven't been able to coach them much. Still, they appreciate the work I do put in. So I'm proud of them. I gotta say, though, Hot Pot is an interesting concept. Every ingredient adds its own flavor, and the end result is so great. It'd be nice if C's could mesh just as well with a ragtag group of members. <laughs> I know everyone's wildly different from each other, but if there's anyone who can make it work, it's you. Anyway, when I'm out there on the front lines, I'll make sure I'm in a position to showcase my strengths. Boxing's taught me that once I get into the rhythm of battle, nothing can stop me. That's my fighting style. Don't forget it. It's nice to be able to share a hot pot with someone else like this. 
Maybe I'll do this with the boxing team too, if I ever get a chance. All right, now how do we finish the bra? Maybe udon or rice porridge? Or how about some protein dumplings? Let's get on with today's lesson. I was gonna wait to tell you this until we sit down to eat, but I've decided to go to Kyushu with Emiru, so this'll be the last time we have ramen together. Emiru? Who's that she's with? I didn't think he'd get so serious about it. He's just a kid. He must have misunderstood. I did it for my own track record as a teacher. He should be grateful. Seems like he's the one who spread the rumors. And now other students are. Just a little longer. We'll celebrate our wedding soon enough. I can't wait. Emiri. So I guess today was the day she was leaving. I had no idea. I was so excited about going with her that I... Hey, 
It's fine. I'm okay. Thanks, though, man. It's not Emery's fault anyway. I screwed things up. Not her. Why, Emery? Why? <laughs> now my nose is running. <laughs> Thanks. If you weren't here, I'd... Why? But I feel so calm when I have someone reading next to me. It's getting pretty late. Should we wrap up for the night?